Shalom, shalom. So here we are. This is part two of the greenhouse build. Got the old one tore down and uh, getting all this gravel out because I'm going to use it uh, as the base for the new greenhouse. So I got one wheelbarrow full and I got uh, two nine by 12 foot sheets of uh, like vapor bear, moisture bear that I'm going to use before I uh, put the gravel down on top of this. And I'm gonna use all this and not gonna let it, it go to waste because uh, probably got about 150 um, to $200 worth of gravel in this. So definitely gonna use it as a good base uh, in the places where it's not as level for the new slab that we got formed up. And uh, yeah, we out here getting it, man. Yam day one, this is part two. There you have it, man. Pretty much got all the rocks out. Just got a couple of them uh, left right here. And uh, I'll show you what where these rocks went on the new slab like i said this is a uh, part two and i got my rocks in there little fruit trees so i put the uh moved the rocks over here to this uh eight by 16 slab i'm gonna get in there and stamp that out real good put my rebar uh in there and then level the uh level the the frame once i level the frame that'll be pretty much it and be ready to pour there you have it hey i'm out here getting this uh this pad together man got my rebar in there you know haven't leveled it yet just putting the rebar in there and uh getting it cut off hey you don't need any expensive uh cut off tools to do your rebar you know a craftsman cut off tool or uh something like this cobalt uh, cut off tool with a cut off disc for metal run you about 99 bucks uh, you know if you catch it on sale you can get it for about 79 but that's what I use to cut the uh, the rebar this is a uh, yeah this is a 10 foot rebar and uh, with it being eight feet wide on this slab I had to cut you know the excess off and a cut off tool right there don't have to use anything expensive to do it you know and uh it'll get the job done so what i have right here is rebar ties and they come in packs like this you can get them in bigger packs i think this is a pack of uh let's see a hundred and i've got one pre-staged right here and i'll show you what this looks like let me show you what this looks like so i've got the rebar tie right here and i'm going to take my tool like this and I'm going to grab that bad boy right there and I'm going to twist it around and it's going to tighten those rebars together just like such and there you have it you got a rebar tied right there good to go and then you see you can lift up the whole thing good to go and I'm gonna keep going on down the line getting it done stay encouraged <laughs> 